Hey you guys, it's Marilee from Rowdy Rustic. I wanted to fill you in on a project that we are working on here at the house. It's kind of a huge undertaking, but we are super excited about it and can't wait to share it with you. So right before I take you inside to kind of show you what we're doing, I wanted to give you kind of a little background of what sparked this idea. It's killing two birds with one stone. My kitchen's super tiny right now. I totally make do with what I have, but as we anticipate putting in a garden next year, food preservation, um, as the season progresses, I know that I'm not gonna have enough space. The layout's kind of laid out funky and um, it's just super tiny. We also have my mother that wants to come stay and Marcus's mother that wants to come stay. So we really wanted a downstairs guest space for them. So this project provides a solution for both of those things. So let's go inside and I will show you what we are tackling. So these rooms will be essentially gutted of all of our belongings. This room, this playroom, everything will come out. The wood on these walls is gorgeous. So we will take that off and save that, use it for something else. We are going to make this space our kitchen, this whole room, kitchen and dining room. This will be gutted. We're gonna take this wall out here. And so this is a big open space. On this side, I'll have my canning shelving right here. We're gonna have a big island with my range. And then over here, since we have plumbing set up for the bathroom, that's where my sink will be, a big pantry in the back corner. And then this window will have to leave and we're gonna put the fridge here. So this is gonna be like a complete <laughs> overhaul of all the things. Um, down the road, I'd love to get a wood cook stove to put right up here. And so let me show you where everything, belongings wise, where it's gonna go in this house. <laughs> okay, so coming out of the living room, we go into this dining area. We've got our fireplace, our freezer in the corner, until we have a spot for it, kind of random. <laughs> and our current patio table, dining table, until we have a real table. So this room will be converted into our living room. Just have to take the table out and then bring the couch in, set up the TV. That is the pretty much what's going on in this room. I don't know if we're gonna change the flooring yet. I do hate the flooring. However, um, depends on cost. Obviously the flooring in here will be redone. I'm not sure if we're gonna get to this right now. This is it, the new home of our living room. Okay, so here is our current kitchen right off of the dining room. This room is going to become a guest room. So we are going to gut everything, take out all the cabinets, pull down the backsplash, repaint the walls. I'm actually gonna reuse these cabinets. They're in decent shape, so reuse them in the new kitchen. However, I am going to paint them because I'm not a huge fan of this dark brown. I'm not positive I'm gonna keep the top cupboards. I may just do open shelving in the new kitchen. For sure, I will keep the bottom ones and be repainting them. Uh, so that is the current situation in our kitchen. We did have this corner, there's a spigot outside, and in this corner, we did have some leakage on the inside. So we'll see what happens with that. We may need to do some more mold control once we pull all this out, but this is the plan, you guys. So this is all gonna be bye-bye very soon. 